Well, cuts could come to Kansas City's fire department, and that leaves a lot of people worried that your safety could be jeopardized. A committee took another look at this proposal today, and Chris Hernandez is live at City Hall with more. Hi, Chris. Well, hi, Jaja. Just in the past 15 or 20 minutes, uh, the City Council's Finance Committee approved a budget for next year, despite the fact that the city is still negotiating with the fire department's, the firefighters union, over all those proposed layoffs we've been talking about. As you remember, the city manager, Troy Schulte, originally proposed cutting $7.6 million out of the fire department's budget by laying off 105 firefighters. Schulte now says that there are ongoing negotiations that focus on eliminating firefighters through retirements at the top end of the pay scale rather than any layoffs. I just talked with Schulte and asked him one key question. How can you pass a budget right now without a final agreement with those firefighters? Uh, take $7.6 million in operating costs out of the department by the end of April 30th, 2013. So that's the plan that we've got it down. So the longer we wait on it, the more draconian the, the cuts have to be. Now that budget approved today by the committee now goes to the full council next week. The budget year starts on May 1st. And now again, the budget that is passed calls for still cutting that $7.6 million out of the fire department, but not through layoffs, instead through retirements. And we're going to have more on this on later editions of NBC Action, uh, 41 Action News, including some talk about a funding victory for the mayor's office. Reporting live at City Hall, Chris Hernandez, 41 Action News.